Arts Chamber Players produces free for everyone professional caliber classical chamber music concerts and is building the future of classical music by offering free violin, voice, and piano lessons in Dallas area schools with limited resources. My name is Morgan Vaughn, and I'm the new executive director of Fine Arts Chamber Players. Founded 42 years ago, FACP's mission is to enrich and enhance the quality of life for North Texas area residents, especially families and children, through free concerts of classical music and educational activities that continues to this day. FACP was founded in 1981 by Rogine Russell and Charles Price with the free, basically Beethoven Festival concert series, which quickly became known as Dallas's premier summer chamber music festival. Today, we consider this our flagship series. In 1984, the Dallas Museum of Fine Arts moved to its new home in the downtown Dallas Arts District and is renamed the Dallas Museum of Art. At the DMA, Fine Arts Chamber Players began its new fall, winter, spring free concert series known as the Bancroft Family Concerts. This series was renamed Hallam Family Concerts as of the 2019-2020 season. In 1989, Artistic Director Rogene Russell created an educational outreach program called Dream Collectors, which integrated other subjects with arts, ranging from dyslexia awareness to character education. In response to requests by public school music educators, Fine Arts Chamber Players developed additional educational outreach programs offered to North Texas public schools at no cost. Every year, Fine Arts Chamber Players teaching artists give more than 500 music lessons in North Texas school, all at no cost to the student or school districts. Since 1981, Fine Arts Chamber Players has reached more than 225,000 children and performed for more than 555,000 North Texas citizens. In 2022, 1,754 concert goers enjoyed our Basically Beethoven Festival over four Sundays in July. These concerts are expertly curated by Dr. Alex McDonald, a Juilliard-educated concert pianist with vast performance and educational experience. Concerts start with the Rising Star segment, featuring a gifted local student, followed by featured players. Featured players are Dallas local professional musicians. 2022's theme was Music in Wartime, a musical study of the human experience in war. Despite its heavy theme, this concert series was, as always, welcoming to families with young children. We make a special effort to involve children in viewing and hearing classical music, including having a kid's table set up in the lobby with books, paper, crayons, and quiet games. For a 2022 BBF poster, local artist and cellist Joseph Kuypers gave us permission to use his works to great effect, each painting representing a concert. The Hallam Family Concert Series of 2022-23 was at different venues within the Dallas city limits, including Moody Performance Hall, Central Commons, and Preston Hollow Presbyterian Church. This year's theme, Through the Looking Glass, explored what happens when perspective shifts and the powerful ways reality changes in response, according to Hallam Family Concert Artistic Director Emily Levine. This thought-provoking programming included tried and true fair Mozart Schumann, as well as emerging composers, female composers such as Florence Price, and artists and composers of color. An example was Wordplay, a concert inspired by the literary wit of Lewis Carroll, expressed in musical puzzles, acronyms, mirror imagery, and musical acrostics. While this might sound heady, each concert welcomes and is engaging for children of all ages, and many are wrapped for the duration, usually about one hour. FACP's long-term music residency programs pair professional teaching artists with underserved students at Dallas schools. In the 2023-2024 school year, we plan to continue our residencies as well as look for other gaps to fill in local arts education. As in the past, FACP teaching artists will lead the Violin Residency Grade 4 at Uplift Atlas Preparatory School for the 11th year and the Piano and Voice Residencies at David W. Carter High School for the 13th year. FACP teaching artists also offer free music lessons to deserving students at James Madison High and Booker T. Washington HSVPA. A recital for students in the High School Music Residency Program is returning post-pandemic this April and will be offered again in 2024. Like FACP concerts, music residencies are offered completely free of charge to students and school districts. 
Due in large part to FACP's music residency program, David W. Carter School applied for and won a $5,000 grant from the Grammy Music Recording Academy. Choir teacher Dimitri Sethry said that the Grammy Music Recording Academy provides grants to public music schools that demonstrate a need and a compelling plan to address that need. FACP is honored to have been part of the success of this program. Since the pandemic, we have filmed and posted each concert on our YouTube channel. Initially thought to be a short-term solution, these videos were so successful that we have continued to produce them despite having returned to live performances. Our YouTube channel has roughly 500 subscribers, and anyone can watch videos from our recent past performances free of charge. This additional venue is in line with our mission of free concerts available to all and was a silver lining to the pandemic lockdown. FACP's free, world-class chamber music concerts encourage anyone to gain an introduction to or develop an established appreciation for classical music and composition. Our classical music training through music residencies in area schools, first and foremost, helps students develop an appreciation for the arts, enriching their lives, broadening their perspectives, and simultaneously teaching them history, math, and cultural awareness. Practicing itself develops important cognitive skills such as memory retention, analytical thinking, and problem-solving abilities, as well as technical skills. Music students necessarily cultivate discipline and perseverance, skills that will serve them throughout their lifetimes, even if they don't pursue careers in music or the arts. Finally, classical music education can serve as a gateway to myriad musical genres and styles, allowing students to explore the vast and varied world of music, expanding their worlds and worldviews. FACP is convinced that our free concerts and music education is a lot more than an hour's respite on a Saturday or just learning to play the violin. It is a game changer for each attendee and student and ultimately for our whole community. FACP is interested in expanding our concert series in a single accessible venue. And while we will not abandon our music residencies, our board, in alignment with FACP's past initiatives, is searching for gaps in music and arts education in order to better serve the community. We know that in the Dallas area, many children and teens do not have the opportunity to engage in or learn about the arts. Private music lessons are out of reach for many Dallas families. But what else is missing? And how can we address this need? While many schools are looking to put the arts back into STEM, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics to become STEAM, how can FACP best help our local youth, knowing that music lessons improve children's cognition and academic performance? With this discovery initiative and in the spirit of the earlier Dream Collectors, FACP is dedicated to isolating programs for marginalized youth and further committed to providing meaningful, dedicated music education outreach to local schools at no cost. FACP's board and staff are inspired to produce more free educational programming for our Dallas audience and to building the future of classical music. Thank you.